morning guys. It is Wednesday and it's time for work. I'm uh, just about to head out. Um, hopefully I won't miss my train this time, which I did yesterday. Oopsie! But yeah, so I'm, I'm just about to head out. Um, a little bit tired this morning. I think I'm tired all mornings. I think that is the whole thing. I should sleep more. I'm having a hard time getting to bed, but it probably will fix itself. Only two and a half weeks until vacation, so I have to kind of push myself to get through it all. But uh, I'm off to work. Someday I truly wish I could take the kiddies with me to work. I was uh, collecting all my stuff and Leia was laying on the floor and just on the back and she was pawing in the air and she was so adorable and I'm like I don't want to leave I want to stay home and cuddle but yeah you have to earn your way in life so that you can buy craft supplies <laughs> good morning guys I hope you have an awesome day well guys uh, I'm home from work I've actually worked a little longer than I should uh, I have to kind of even it out during the weeks, but I probably will stay a little bit longer tomorrow. Tomorrow will be actually be an afternoon day, so I will have a whole bunch of hours in the morning that I try to figure out what to do with, because I don't start until noon. Uh, we have a retro meeting and they want me to be there to, and we need to talk about things, so that's, that's good. Right now, uh, I'm updating my computer. I have a whole bunch of programs that is updating because uh, there are a lot of new support for new uh, OS, OS things, yeah. But I also have to move the um, PDF for the Frosted Pumpkin Stitchery uh, pageant that came today, so I have to sit down and do that. So I'm gonna go around drinking my coffee, uh, setting up the project, pushing it to my iPad, and then I'm going to sit down and do that. Because I am pretty tired, and I'm actually going to rest today, because I have a long day tomorrow. always have long days, I think. But they're fun days. I love working. Yeah, I know. It's strange, but I really do. I had a lot of fun today. And I kind of realised that maybe i am good at my job i have had one of those kind of dips again where i'm very insecure feeling that my cards i do isn't good enough and nothing i do is good enough and i, I think cross stitch is one of those things that i feel it's good enough and therefore i have a tendency to really fall back into cross stitching when i, I get a, a bad kind of doesn't have any self-confidence in myself and then I get better and then I feel like maybe I can actually do my job even though I have a splitting headache uh, and stuff but yeah I'm in a better mood today and I'm gonna try not to overdo it because um, if I kind of push myself to be really 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 happy uh, then I kind of get sad in a couple of days yeah because sometimes that is how it works yeah, but yeah, off to the Frosted Pumpkin Stitcher world. By the way, have you seen the new uh, Frosted Pumpkin Stitcher thingy? They are uh, sharing a new sampler for the Christmas thing. I think it was four mysteries episodes, and I really, really like this mystery one that I'm doing right now, so I might actually be getting that, and that is tomorrow. Frosted Pumpkin Stitcher is going to make me poor. Cross Stitch makes me poor, but it's so much fun. Good evening guys. I have been sitting here in my sofa most of the evening and I have been doing my cross stitching of the uh, Frosted Pumpkin Stitchery uh, Storytime Sampler. And I thought I'd show you. Here you have it. This is how long I come. The, it's a little bit bright I think but uh, this is how long I have come. I would have wanted to finish it today but as you see uh, it's actually pretty late right now and I have a whole bunch of different small things to add including her mouth and yeah it's going really good I really like it um, since changing to the color pattern to go by it goes much much faster to stitch so that is awesome I usually don't like color pattern but 
a, a kind of getting a feel for this kind of pattern so yeah so there is she I'm using my uh, little dragon because I put the uh, storybook away and I don't remember where I put it it's in one of the, the these these boxes I thought I had put it in this box but I hadn't so yeah I'm using the dragon for this today I'm actually gonna put the needle on the back side that is something I always do I put the needle on the back side because that magnet is a little bit stronger and then um, it's just when I have to rest the needle on the front side that I put it on him but he's a cute little guy yeah um, we're gonna talk about the uh, stitch along I really wanted to make something for the stitch along so in the link in the description down below you will have a link which will show you um, which will go to a new started Facebook group I've st started this group for this cell specifically uh, I don't know if it will be something else in the future and I don't think it will be something else in the future I'm just planning it for this cell and um, from the start I, I kind of uh, thought I would start it at um, uh, start of August but I think we are actually pushing it a little bit further in the future so September October somewhere there um, I want to have a conversation with you uh, if you go and join the group we can have a conversation of when we want the South start um, Freddie wanted uh, couldn't do it uh, in the start of August and I kind of realized that I probably want to buy a good fabric for it and I have a delivery time of at least a month so I have to look into that um, it says it's gonna be 28 count castle linen I'm thinking about going to all these different um, fabric stores that sell hand dyed fabric see if I can find a antique linen with a tad of mottling in because I think that would might look good might compete with the black work but I don't know so it's the black work uh, hummingbird sow uh, and as I said starts September October somewhere we're gonna discuss it in the group and find a date that works for everyone just join the link is down below um, there is a big chance that I will buy a couple more patterns from the same designer um, I'm looking at the bird patterns. I think it was two or three bird patterns that they had, uh, which was a little bit more elongated, which really, really beautiful. I really, really love this design. I love this splash of color, which not just color, but actually something tangible, and then the black work coming out from it. I really love the design. It's not something I would design, but it's something I really want to stitch. So, I am going to go broke someday. But that's how it is. Yeah, that's how it is. <laughs> but, um, right now I'm going to head to bed. So, good night, sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Bye!